enough of that jazz. Let's learn some math. Okay, so what we're doing is we're finding the domain of the function represented in the graph. First off, domain. That is what x can be. And remember, your x is your side to side. So what you got to do is almost in your mind destroy the concept of up and down because you just want to know from side to side how far does it go. Okay, so let's look on here. All right, let's start with the lowest it can be. It is on 5. So 5 is the lowest. Now let's go straight over to the furthest right. That's a 3. That's where it hits. So 3. So it goes from 5 to 3. All right. Oh, oh, oh. Did you catch it? Negative 5. That was my fault. If you caught that, you get 10 points to Gryffindor. Good job. So negative 5 to 3. Which one of these does that fit? All of them say domain. Everything's the same. So really our only changes are over here. And it is negative 5 to 3. And that little fella is your answer. Remember, domain is what X can be. And range would be up and down, what Y can be. We don't care about that right now, though, do we? Hit them with the outro. Hey, thanks for showing up. Give me a subscribe and check out TarverAcademy.com. Pizza? Wow, that was good stuff. Go to TarverAcademy.com. I got Facebook, Twitter, and I got another YouTube channel. If you could, please subscribe. That would be super, super, super cool of you. Na-na-na-na-na-na. Goodbye.